Hello to all of you. This is Dr. Dawal Mehta and today we will understand how to run regression analysis with dummy variables in Python. But first of all, we will have to understand what is the concept of dummy variable also known as one hot encoding. Say for example, in our data set, we are having three sections A, B and C. So, now I will convert this section into the variable a b and c so the presence of a will be indicated by 1 1 and its absence will be indicated by 0 now here b is present its presence will be indicated here by 1 1 and its absence will be indicated by 0 similarly the presence of c will be indicated by 1 1 and its absence will be indicated by 0 now when we will run the regression analysis if there are three dummies, then we will in only include two dummies in our equation because it has been seen that if you include all the three dummies, then it will cause a problem of dummy variable trap. Now, why we have created the concept of dummy variable? When we run the regression analysis with this categorical variable, it is very difficult to find the effect of individual categories. So, we convert them. These categories are converted into numeric so that we can get the effect of individual sections. As already I have explained, we will drop one of the dummies. Now, the value of this dummy will be captured by constant. Any dummy which is dropped, its value will, will be captured by constant. So, if we are having three dummies, we will only include two in our equation. Otherwise, we will have a problem of dummy variable trap if we include all three of them. Now, how we can do this? Let's see in Python. So, import pandas as pd, import matplotlib as mpl, import stressmodel.formula.api as sm, from scalon.linear underscore model, import linear regression, from skypy, import stats, import seaborn as sns, import numpy as np, Import matplotlib.pyplot as plt. Import statsmodel.api as s. Now, I will import this data frame, dummies, in Python. So, df is equal to pd.read underscore csv. r is used for the smooth import of the data file. df.head, when I will generate, when I will run it, I will get this data frame. Now, here, the repair is number uh, how many repairs have been done months is months since last hired so electrical is type of repair this is repair time in hours so first of all we will generate the scatter plot so plt dot scatter df months df repair color green plot y label plot title and we will get simple linear regression where it shows that with months repair increases. Now I want to fit the model. From statsmodel.formula.api import OLS. REG is the name of the model, is equal to OLS, formula is equal to repair tilde. Repair is a dependent variable and months is an independent variable. Data is DF. Now this tilde is located below the escape button above the tab on your keyboard. So now when I run fit1 is equal to reg.fit, then I'll write down print fit1.summary. So it will give me the summary of the entire OLS. I'll request all my viewers to kindly refer the previous video to understand the flow of this series. The first thing which you have to see here is this values should be less than 0 0.05 so that we can say that months is affecting the repairs. Here, the p, p value is less than 0 0.05 and therefore, the effect is seen of months on repairs. The second thing which you should see is the overall p value. That should also be less than 0 0.05. And therefore, we can say that the model exists. This is the explanatory power of the model. 53%, it is less. Above 60% is considered to be quite good. It means that months is able to explain repairs. 
that is a variation once is able to explain in repairs 53 percentage so my equation will be repairs is equal to 2.1473 plus 0 0.3041 into months with every increase in one month the number of repairs increases that is 1 into 0 0.3041 plus 2.1473 now I want to create the dummies for type of repair, electrical and mechanical. So I will be using dummies is equal to pd.getDummies df type. Then df1 is equal to pd.concat df dummies axis1. And then when I will run df1, I will get two dummies, one for electrical and another for mechanical. So electrical is a type of a repair x2 is 0 for mechanical repair and x2 is equal to 1 for uh, electrical repair. So first case is electrical repair and second case is mechanical repair. Now I will drop one of them as already discussed. So df1 dot drop type mechanical in place true x is 1. So df1 I have dropped mechanical. Now its value will be captured by the constant. So this is df1. Now I will run REG regression is equal to OLS formula repair tilde months plus electrical data is equal to DF1. Fit2, I am creating another model. Fit1 was a previous model. Fit2 is equal to REG dot fit round bracket print fit2 summary round brackets over. The first thing which you should see is the p value. Now you can see the p value of months and electrical are less than 0 0.05 and therefore. They are significantly affecting the repair. Moreover, the overall p value is also less than 0 0.05 and therefore model exists. Now you can see the uh, explanatory power has increased drastically. So months and electrical are able to explain 85% variance in repairs. Quite good. So my equation now is repairs is equal to 0 0.9305 plus 0 0.3876 into months. 0.3876 into months plus 1.2627 into electrical. So, if it is an electrical repair, I will indicate this thing as 1. If it is a mechanical repair, I will indicate this thing as 0. So, the value of the mechanical repair is captured by the constant. So, this is a way you can run regression analysis using dummy variables, also known as hot encoding in Python. For more value, uh, for more videos on uh, data science using python kindly subscribe to my channel you can also refer my playlist in which i have already uploaded many videos which are related to data science using python kindly subscribe to my channel and please don't forget to press the like button